Welcome to IP Blitzball, an official IP Blitzball League. You heard that right. We have been deemed an official league by the Blitzball guy. Who's the Blitzball guy? Well, the Blitzball guy is plain and simple. He is the inventor of the game that we play. He is the inventor of the green little ball and moves like crazy. And let me tell you this, the boys are very thankful and very excited to be a part of the family. Absolutely. I'll tell you that right now. Does he have any uh, social media platforms? He does, and I'm gonna put it in the video right now. All right, first topic. One thing I would like to see personally with the IP Blitzball League is a little bit more forgiveness on ground balls uh, that might get through in real life, maybe ground balls up the middle, hard ground balls, what are your thoughts? Yeah, I completely agree there. I mean, this is a pitching game, the ball moves a lot, and I think we gotta reward the hitters. Absolutely. Uh, so, we'd love to see more runs, more bombs, and more fun. One thing I would love to see implement in these blitz ball games is a little bit more defense. I feel like there is a big lack of defense on the field. I get it, it's 2v2, there's one outfielder out there and it's very hard, I do understand, but I feel like they should start talking about ways to implement more defense, more great plays in the outfield, and uh, you know, sports center top tens. Absolutely. Now, there is a team in the league that has only played one game so far, but I must say, they, they look a little sneaky good. That team is the Man Vans. In their only game, the star pitcher minivan had five strikeouts. That's just in one game. That the is very, game. very impressive right there. Now, if they can sort of find a groove and get things going, I think they could be a real threat down the line. I really do. I know they have some baseball background, so switching over to Blitzball is a little tricky. It is very hard to throw this ball. Speaking about teams with potential, let's talk about the Mullet Mafia. They are two great players that you know what, it was their first game, so let's give them a little chance to, to catch up with the speed of things, but I really feel like they can come out swinging and put up great fights every time they come out there. Yeah, after their first game, we did do a little bit of an exhibition mm -hmm. afterwards, and they hit a lot better once they got their groove down, Absolutely. so that's going to be something to watch out for. You know what, Jeremy, let me ask you something real quick. If the season ended right now, who would the MVP go to? Uh, well, there's a lot of numbers that we'll look at a little bit later. There's a lot of factors, but one guy um, who I like who's due for a home run coming up is Chunky Chuck. The guy has been seeing the ball well. I think he's really going to get a good piece in his next at-bat, and I think he's going to take one. Absolutely. Chunky Chuck has that beautiful swing. He puts it in play every single time. And, you know, it's a, it's a very hard game, but his exit velo is top three. Top three in the league. Let's go throw it over to Brian. Let's talk about average. John, let's just throw it out there. Yeah. Minivan, batting 333, also tied with some guy batting 333 as well, in only one game. At second, we got Tiger Bomb, 281. These guys are feared up at the plate. Don't leave nothing hanging. Now, let's get the averages out of the way and let's talk about home runs. Leading the league, Letty Mops with Cinco at second, Tiger Bomb with four, Chunky Chut with three, and Red Timber, our fallen soldier, he did a Cespedes on us with two. That's all I got. Heading over to the defensive side, pitching, we got our top three strikeout leaders in the league. Jeff McFluffin with 17, Tiger Bomb with 15, and Chunky Chut with 13. Excellent reporting, Brian. You know, I always love looking at a good stat sheet. Absolutely. We're going to move on to our blitz picks of the day, and my pick is the Lumberjacks. They have two wins under their belts already. They're looking hot, they're rolling, and I think they can come away with two today. You know, I really feel like the Spanglish are coming out with a 2-0 sweep on the day. I know they lost their first loss to the Lumberjacks, and they're pretty angry. And I know some trash talk has been going on behind the scenes, so Tiger and Chud are going to come out swinging today. I know that for a fact. Well, we'll see if that's true. And it looks like that is all the time we have today. Uh, let's send it over to Mac and Biddy's West. Ah, welcome to IP Blitzball, an official IP Blitzball league. We have a two-game series coming up between the 4-1 and one Spanglish versus the 2-3 and three Lumberjacks. Here are some stats for you. Let's not take too long to look at those. Let's just get into the action. All right, finally some blitz ball action for you. Jeff on the mound, Tiger at the plate. First pitch is fouled away. 0-1. Nice loopy curveball misses. That's a new pitch he's working on. Whoa, watch your lips there, man. 3-1. Swung on and missed for the full count. Swing. Base hit, 5-6 hole. Runner on first. 1-2 is just missing Chunky Chud's head. Swing and a miss, 2-2. Two two. 
Oh, pardon me. That is a strikeout. Forgive me so much. Another hit by Tiger Bomb. First and second. They got something threatening here. Three and two. Now it's going to be a lob. What do we got here? Swing. High drive. Center field. Letty mops back. And he crashes over the fence. He really gives 125% effort every play. Man, that's going to be on the highlight reels. Man, oh man, 3-0 Spanglish off that Chunky Chut home run, and Jeff comes back with a strikeout low and away. 0-2 to Chut, and it nicks the top of the strike zone. Yes, sir, Ritos. Let's go to the bottom of the first. Letty at the plate, Chut on the mound. Swing, ground ball for out number one. That's going to be a lob from Chut and a swing from Jeff and a pop-up from Jeff, out number two. The 3-0 to Letty, swung on and hit right up the middle for a nice piece. Runner on first, that one misses way outside. Here is a lob. Swing and another base hit. The Lumberjacks have a rally threatening. 3-1 and one is going to be taken for another lob. What can Letty do? Swing, weak grounder. Unbelievable. Top of the second. Tiger Bomb up at the plate. 3-2 count. Gets the lob pitch. Works that count all the way down to a base hit through the 5-6 hole. And Chunky Chut, what do you know? It's going to do the same thing. Line drive up the middle. Good base knocks here. First and second. Top of the second. Three deuces. No, that's two. Just kidding. And that is going to be an, a ground out up the middle. We got one down. Runners on first and second. And that is another ground out to the second baseman. Two down. Letty Mops gets him to ground out to the shortstop. We're going to the bottom half of the inning, folks. And I ain't messing around. Tiger Bomb pitches one in there for a strike called pitch. We got the big man coming up here. He's going to fly it back to the pitcher. And he's going to record that out. Trying to get out number three. Works it all the way to a lob. And that is, I believe, a base hit. We got Jeff McFluffin. That is going to go ahead and strike out down the middle. All right. Top three now. Jeff up at the plate. And he gets the strikeout. Downhill two seam. Dirty movement. One out. 3-0 count to Tiger. And it is outside for the lob pitch. And it is a ground out. 3-2 count, two outs, top three. And it is outside for another lob, back-to-back -back lob. And it is another ground out. Three outs, and we're going to the bottom of the third. Chunky up on the mound, throws the Letty. Gets the two-seam high and pops him up. Four. What a beautiful catch for the first out. One out to Jeff. And is a high and inside two seam that gets the top left corner. Beautiful pitch. Jeff up at the plate. Here comes the pitch. And it is a base hit. Runner on first, two outs, bottom third. Next pitch. And it is a weak runner to the pitcher. Three outs. Let's go top four. All right, top of the fourth. Tiger Bomb at the plate. He's going to get a base hit into left field. Runner on first. Here comes Chut at the plate. That one's over his head. Man, they are headhunting Chut today. Swing, pop up. We got one away quickly. Here it is, one and one. Swing, weak grounder. That's going to be out number two. Huge outs, huge outs. The 0-0 oh to Chut. Nice sinker, and it's going to be a grounder. Bottom of the fourth. The Lumberjacks need this. Swing, and an out for Jeff McFluffin. Nice contact. Chunky Chut's going to dive, and he cannot come away with that. We have a runner on first. Lob pitch. Weak grounder. Come on, guys. I'm rooting for you. Full count. Lob. This is huge from Letty. Swing. 
Are they giving him a hit? They better. First and second. Threatening stuff here. Two and two is going to be taken. The Lumberjacks win the first game of this series. Let me give you a word from our sponsor. Are you a gamer that rages? Hacker! You're hacking! Do you die to oh, stupid things? Come on! Lag! Shut up, Mom! Shut up! Did you break your controllers? Introducing an all new drink that cools down your meltdown. Rager Raid. The aid for ragers. Rager Raid is also funded in part by the Federal Bank member FDIC issue number 3175. For any more questions, visit Rager Any more questions, call 310 9 Welcome to game two of the series between the Lumberjacks and the Spanglish. The Spanglish took the first one thanks to Chunky Chut's home run in the very first inning. But that's enough about this game. Let's get it going to game number dos. Welcome back to game two, everybody, of the series. We got Chunky Chut up at the mound, throwing to Letty Mops, and that is a foul ball. On one count, top of the first, throws one in there, two seam for a strikeout. Out number one. Here goes Jeff up to the plate. Ground ball to the shortstop. That is out number two. Chunky Chut looking solid at the mound. Comes in here with the changeup. Floats right in. Looking for the third out. We're going to go ahead and go to the bottom half of the first inning. Everybody hold your bracelets. Chunky Chut up at the plate. Hits a double off the wall. A double to start the inning. Bottom half of the first still. We got Jeff up at the mound. Throws a pitch outside corner for a strike. Out number one. Jeff coming up again. But he misses for the lob. And that is out number two. Run on second. Two down. Three no count. Ground ball to the shortstop for an out. All right. Scoreless as we go to the top of the second. Swing by Jeff McFluffin. That's going to be a ground out for one away. The three and one coming in, got him. Strike three outside part of the plate. The 0 and 0 is popped up by Jeff McFluffin way up in the air and will be caught by Tiger Bomb. Let's go to the bottom half of the second now, the one and one. Swing, base hit up the middle by Chunky Chut. The three and 0 to Tiger Bomb is a weak grounder for out number one. One and one to Chunky Chut coming in. Curveball swung on and hit on the ground for out number two. The 0 and 1. Swung at, shot, left field. You can kiss that baby goodbye. Show whamma. 2 0 Spanglish as Chunky Chut grounds one out to the pitcher. Inning number three coming at you. All right, top three. Chunky Chut up on the mound and he throws the pitch. 3 2 count and is low for a lob. Here comes the lob to Letty. And he swings and misses on a lob. That's rare to see, but they get the one out. Top three, here comes Jeff. And there's a base hit down the third base line. Run on first, three, two count, one out. And it is wide, almost hits Jeff again. Here comes a lob. And another base hit up the middle. Look at that tail on that action ball. Another pitch, one and one. And it is a weak grounder for two outs. Run on first and second, top three. Here comes the pitch to Letty. And it is a nice two-seamer. Get some looking. What a beautiful movement pitch. Bottom three now. 3-1 count to Tiger. And he grounds out weakly. Needs to hit the weight room. 3-2 count. One out. And it is a nice two seam from Jeff. We've seen that before. Great movement. 2-1 count. Two outs. And there's another ground ball. Tiger loves to be weak today. All right. Last chance for the Lumberjacks as Letty Mops takes the ball four for a lob. Let's see what he can do. Absolutely nothing as he pops it up. He is disgusted. One away in the top of the fourth. Swing, nice little oppo piece by Jeff McFluffin. They have a pulse here late in the game. Swing, Letty Mops chokes yet again. Down to their final out. Jeff McFluffin takes one. Swing and a pop up. The Spanglish are going to take this game as well. Absolutely disgusting. Get me out of here. The Spanglish take the two-game series sweep thanks to the long ball. 
The Lumberjacks need to bounce back next time. We'll see, though. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, peace out and blitz ball.